Today we are heading out on our Kinabatangan River tour, which is three days, two nights. But first, I'm gonna go and try one more last ditch attempt to get a camera with a longer zoom. really good and unexpected. I really didn't think I'd be finding this new camera that I really wanted anywhere. It didn't seem to be anywhere. Now the wildlife shots should get way better. Quick breakfast before we've got to check out the place we stayed in last night. We got two meagerings as standard and mum has got roti, right? So a successful breakfast all round really. I just had a minor allergic reaction and they decided to put shrimp in the meagering, which Hannah is also allergic to. So two out of the three of us are now <laughs> having an allergic reaction. Not ideal. And so we have just reached Hotel Sandakan. Now this is the pickup point for our tour that we're doing on the Kinabatangan River. And we're doing it through a company called River Junkie. It's a three day, two night tour. And what we get included is our transport to and from the river, accommodation in the resort, lodge kind of place, all of the activities and our food in between. And we paid 90 pounds each for it, which seemed pretty reasonable for us for everything that we're gonna be doing. We wanted to book it in advance, although you can definitely book it, I think just on the day or when you're here, you can go and stay in a lodge and book different walks and boat trips each day. But we wanted to do it ahead of time just because we knew Hannah was on a short trip and we wanted to make sure we could do this in time. But also because we wanted to make sure we could be in like a secure place where we could make sure that my gear and everything was gonna be safe. Really looking forward to it, but we've also been super lucky because River Junkie have been working with a newer resort and they've managed to upgrade us for no extra cost to this new resort. So we're looking forward to seeing what that's like. <laughs> so we have just arrived at the resort. It looks crazy cool. We're literally right on the river. It feels good around here. Just picked up the key to our room and we're just going to head over there now. And this is our room then. Oh wow, this looks so nice. So we have just arrived at our room. I think because we got upgraded, we've also managed to get like a family room maybe as well, which is pretty awesome. So we've literally got a sort of like bunk bed arrangement here with two beds, a massive four poster double bed over here. And then this is our door where we just come in. And in here, is where we have like our bathroom area and shower just up there as well which looks pretty epic there's no way we expected anything like this i think when we booked we booked like a we were going to be part of a dorm room like a six bed dorm room but because of the upgrade we have this epic So we 
settled into the room and now we've just come back to the sort of reception lobby kind of area because it's 3.30 which means it is tea time where you get a few snacks and you can have some refreshments too. And this one? Uh, Indian. Hey. <laughs> Good food? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so snack time is over. It's four o'clock and we are just about to get on the boat for the first time. Just a few minutes into our first river cruise and we could not believe our eyes. A majestic, plodding pygmy elephant right on the banks of the river just in front of us. It's a male. Mel. Mel? Yeah, Mel. Oh, okay. Yeah, with the tusk. Yeah, you can see the tusk. As you can see the necklace, it's the tracker. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, the satellite wow. tracker. Where is the other one? Where is the other one? So it's oh, for the Sabah Wildlife Department Turning to, to detect the location, the current locations for the elephant. Wow, beautiful! We have been going a few minutes and we just saw pygmy elephants like my mind is blown well we saw one pygmy elephant my mind is blown the pygmy elephants of borneo are the smallest species of elephant on the planet at around 30 percent smaller than other asian elephants they were once believed to be the descendants of a domesticated herd given to the Sultan of Sulu in the 1800s, but DNA evidence proved these elephants were isolated around 300,000 years ago from their cousins on mainland Asia and Sumatra. Over time, they have become smaller, with relatively larger ears, longer tails and straighter tusks. Why are we so far back? The boats on the Kinabatangan River must not go near the banks when pygmy elephants have been sighted. Classified as endangered and with an estimated number of fewer than 1,500, the well-being of these beautiful animals is of utmost importance. Of course, minimising the human-elephant contacts not only protects the elephants, but humans too. As such, we were informed that our scheduled night walk was cancelled due to the elephants roaming in the area of our lodge. just up here that's a clinic it's a moving clinic that moves around and it like just works for the convenience of the villagers that live up and down the river pretty cool it's an initiative from the government and 
for the night walk it will be cancelled because it's too dangerous to get inside when there's the elephant in there. Okay. Thank you so much. Terima kasih. That was out of this world. Incredible. And we are just back from our first river cruise here at the Kinabatangan River. And words can't even describe just how incredible that was. Like the amount of wildlife we saw how lucky we were to see the wildlife we did see. Like the guides just kept saying we were ridiculously lucky. And well, basically they said there's a big five of Borneo wildlife. And that would be the pygmy elephants, the crocodiles, the hornbills, the proboscis monkeys, and the orangutans. And the only one of those that we didn't see was the orangutans. And to see the rhinoceros hornbills, these like huge colorful hornbills, and to see the pygmy elephants was just out of this world. I was so, so thankful to have the new camera with the crazy zoom. I think it's like obviously very hard to keep it steady and also like the quality does drop down a bit, but it's just something that, even though I think the quality on this, like my main camera that I normally vlog with, I think the quality is amazing, but if you want to get that zoom and be able to sort of see the detail in some of the animals, like having this other camera for me and for this wildlife stuff that we're doing over the next few days is just an absolute, God send. How was it, Anna? I had really high expectations after Baco, especially, but oh my, they just like blew them out of the water. I can't believe we saw everything, and especially if we managed to see orangutans over the next like two days that we got here. Oh God, I love it. How do you find it, Mum? You look quite relaxed under here. Actually. I am. I am just still staggered at what I've seen. Those beautiful horn bells just gliding across the sky. What was it? One, two, three. Glide. Beautiful. How are the elephants? <gasps> Amazing. Bigger than I thought. I thought they'd be tiny, tiny. Because of, but they weren't. But they were still small and lovely. <laughs> So it is dinner time here on the river and the vibe is really nice here at the lodge. Like just everyone's sitting and eating, getting our food from like a whole selection of different things over here. We've got a whole range here, we've got rice and veggies, some chicken, calamari, tempeh and some more veggies. Yeah baby. rather questionable dancing but it's been a very very good first day here in the Su natural Sukau Billet Resort I think that's the name of the the place we're staying it was really nice to find out that they'd upgraded us from a dorm into our own private sort of family room that was a, a very nice find and then seeing seeing all the wildlife especially the hornbills and pygmy elephants I just what a day. Anyway, it's only about 9 p.m. here, but we are going to be up at about 5 a.m. tomorrow because we're doing a sort of sunrise cruise, I think. So I'm going to thank you so much for watching. Big love. It feels good around here.